to give me apps, you're at more. The number one app store, give me apps.com. Download apps for any smartphone or tablet. If you're a developer, pay no developer fees. Keep up to 100% of your profits and withdraw your earnings by PayPal whenever you want. No app store, let's do that. Today we're checking out Grayscale by Blue Water Publishing for the iPhone and iPad. The full title is Grayscale Live Black and White Filters BW Photo. With this app, you can take pictures while applying photo filters on the fly. Compare this to apps like Instagram where you take the photo first and then apply the filter. Here you are applying the filter live while taking the photograph. Guys, you can choose between 100 unique filters. You have them at your fingertips. You can turn photographs into charming and unforgettable works of art. Take straight black and white photographs or add special effects like old time photo plate or paper. You can take live vignette photos. For this review, we're going to use this uh, picture that I pulled out of a jewelry catalog. You can see that it's in full color. Take a look at the main screen here. You can choose to add a border, black, white. You can randomize the filter or just choose the filter straight away. You can use your front facing or rear view camera. We're obviously going to be using the rear view camera for the review. You have your choice of standard sepia, color, vignette, and special. As you can see with the black and white selection, you have quite a few to choose from. We're going to use our photo here, our picture that we pulled from the catalog as the subject. As you can see, um, when we do pull up our device, it takes that color photo and automatically turns it into black and white. We're going to bring this up a bit so we can get it in view. We can choose between the many filters. You have black and white. You have uh, Conrad. As you can see, the name of the filter appears in the middle of the screen when you select the filter. You have um, Truman. You have Deep. Here you have Analog. You have Twilight. My personal favorite is Noir because it reminds us of the film noir genre of the 1940s. I'm pretty sure that's why it's called that. You have many more to choose from. Red LT. You have Heavy. You have Orange. You have Pen. And it goes on and on. We're going to take a photo using the Noir filter. We're going to tap on that, and all you need to do is select the filter you want, press that down button, we'll do that one more time so you can see that we had that off of the view of the camera. Once again, we have Noir, take that, and you tap this icon here, and you press the camera shutter button. We're going to bring our picture into view, and once you do that, snapped, we did not have it in view, so we'll go back. You can preview or tap to go back, we just did that. We're going to bring this further down and take our picture. We're a little close to the subject, by the way. But once you snap that, you can see that we have more of the picture in view. If, still, if it still didn't work out, you can try that again. And here we are. And as you can see, it's now um, in view. Um, we're a little dark just because we want to make sure the contrast is fine for the video. But you can see the picture right there. And once you have what you want, you can um, either you know upload that to your favorite uh, social network. You see the Instagram icon there. Uh, put it in your gallery. You can try again. It's up to you. All right, so that was just one of the filters. Let's show you the other ones here. We're going to bring our um, subject back here, which is this photograph, this picture. And uh, we'll look at some of the other filters here. Now, guys, this is not a free app. It is $2.99, but then again, you do get plenty of filters to play with rather than the dozen or so that you get with Instagram. Take a look at these uh, monochrome filters or monochromatic. You have red. You have your turquoise. You have your evergreen, which is pretty cool. Uh, what else? You have your Mars. Get that Martian red. You press it twice there. You have pine. You have polar. What else do we have here? Let's try that one more time. We have um, favorite color from our Commodore 64 back in the day, the 8-bit cyan or cyan, however you want, to, you want to pronounce it. Take a look at that. You have your unicorn, and it goes on and on. This is self-explanatory. You have your hot filter. Once you have what you want, once again, you tap on the um, down icon. You get your picture in the view, which we don't have at the moment. And you snap your photo. You can see there we didn't get the entire picture in the view, but it is the color of the filter that we chose. So, as you can see here, you can add the uh, border. Again, you can choose black or white. It's up to you. Look at that. And there it is. You can either keep that or you can exit out. And uh, once you keep that, well, see, we don't have Instagram on our device here. So, uh, that's why it says, please install Instagram. Believe it or not, I have that on my phone, but I do not have it on my iPad. So, there it is, guys. And, of course, you can tap to go back. So, now that we know how to use the app, we'll just show you the different filters that are available. No need to keep snapping photos over and over again. You know how it works. And we are approaching our five minute mark here. You have your vignette, take a look at that. You have quite a few to choose from. Let's get our picture back in the view actually because with the vignette you need to have the, um, the, the stuff surrounding it, right? Take a look at that 1950s. You have relish. Take a look at that, you have cool. And you have sizzle. Now notice the circle around it, there's your vignette. So that's pretty cool, you have all of that. You can tap on this icon here to go back if you want to. You have your special effects. Let's show you this one here. We're going to move on. You have your um, pixel, pixelate, which is great. That's nice. Uh, look at that one more time. 
You have this one here as well. You have the sketch, which is great. Great stuff. Now, once again, uh, you're winning here because you are able to see um, what it would look like before you snap the photo, and that's an advantage that you don't get with the um, many photo, fil photo filter apps that are available. Okay, do check it out. Do check out the listing. Prices do change, so we won't quote the price. Uh, but this is called Grayscale. This is by Blue Water Publishing, a nice app that gives you um, nearly 100 creative and unique filters to play around with. And, of course, um, you can turn your photographs into charming and unforgettable works of art. Guys, you are checking out our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash appmall. Give me apps is the world's number one independent app store. Download any Android app. Check out our iPhone and Windows phone showcases. If you're a developer, check this out. You pay no developer fees. You get to keep up to 100% of your profits and withdraw your earnings via PayPal whenever you want. No app store anywhere. Let's do that. This is Grayscale Live Black and White Filters BW Photo for the iPhone and iPad. We hope you enjoyed this review as much as we did, guys. Till next time.